TJIF friends, I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Alita Loresco with your need to know weather. You'll notice slim rain chances for today. Unfortunately, no zone pollution watch is in effect. And the pollution watch will continue through the weekend. We've also got a heat advisory that begins at noontime today. Look at the highs today in the upper 90s. Now we get a few cooling downpours for tomorrow, but not before that temperature reading is expected to reach 98. We'll take the edge off a little bit of that heat on Sunday with a few of those downpours during the early part of the day. Highs will drop down into the mid 90s. Here's a look at the highs for this afternoon away from the coast. Those temperatures not too off uh, to not too far off from hitting the century mark close to triple digit temperatures. And then I mentioned that heat advisory beginning at noontime today and continuing through 7 p.m. on Saturday. And we do anticipate those heat index values to surpass 108 in many locations, potentially up to 112 during the afternoon hour. So here's a look at future track. That shower for today will stay slim. In fact, most areas, especially north of I-10, should stay dry. But south of I-10, there could be a brief heavy rain shower. Uh, during the afternoon hour. Saturday morning, we are waking up to mostly warm, humid conditions, but dry. And then as we get into the afternoon and early evening hours, we're going to be watching as a boundary begins to move closer toward the I-10 corridor, especially before the sun goes down. Saturday evening, the early part of the evening, you can see some widely scattered showers and storms beginning to form and move through the Houston area between that uh, anywhere between 4 to 8 p.m. time frame and then down toward the coastline around 9 o'clock in the evening. It won't be a complete washout, but there will be an hour or two where you will be dodging some downpours. Sunday morning, waking up to mostly dry conditions, perhaps a few brief heavy rain showers. Sunday as well could be dealing with some wet weather. Over the next seven days, you are seeing an occasional brief heavy shower, at least through Monday, but most of the rain is going to congregate over the eastern Gulf of Mexico, over Florida is where we anticipate over five inches of rain as we monitor a tropical system that has a medium to high chance of developing over the next few days. That probability has increased through Sunday to 50% and over the next seven days up to 80%. And there you can see the uh, area in red. That is where the formation odds are looking the highest over the next several days. So with that storm system staying over the eastern Gulf of Mexico, that is going to mean mostly dry and hot weather for us here along the western Gulf of Mexico. So you can see for next week, we're keeping the rain chances out and drying the temperatures up. We should see somewhere in the mid to upper 90s. All right, that's a look at the forecast on this Friday. Thanks for watching.